I'm going to do a song first. Uh, I'll give you a little background on it. A few years back, I got a note from a friend of mine down in North Carolina. And he said, hey, Rog, you know that book I've been working on? Random House picked it up. And uh, they're going to publish it. And he had written a book about uh, an area of North Carolina that is on the northeast part of the Smokies. That is the national forest area that's required by the government to put in a national park. And back when the government did this in the early 30s, they did pretty much the same thing the state did to the people over at Quabbin. They came in and said, uh, we're going to put a national forest in here and you're off your land. The only difference was they didn't flood it, you know. But they were, the people there were allowed to live there, but they couldn't let any of their children or relatives stay. And it really caused a lot of discourse. And it's, to this day, there's a lot of bitterness about it. But this song is called Catalucci. What is life but a short passage through this old world with all its trouble? What is love but a few memories we may hold? Of some place or someone who was part of us. But I remember the mountain springtime and how that blue haze hung on the ridges. I can still feel the promise I felt for tomorrow. It was a promise deeper than the green of the laurel found on the creek banks in the Catalucci. All things change is a hard lesson learned as the years and our youth slip behind us but when the law takes the land where our families have always been what is left but life itself to take from us. But I remember the mountain springtime and how that blue haze hung on the ridges. But I no longer Feel the promise I felt for tomorrow. All I see is sadness and sorrow. On the creek banks in the Catalucci, I no longer. Feel the promise I felt for tomorrow. All I see is sadness and sorrow on the faces in the Catalucci.
Lira. Thank you. This next song is called uh, To Find a Way Back Home. And uh, I wrote it a couple of years ago, but it, it sure is appropriate for the last month or so. And I uh, just wanted to do it. So. Mm -hmm. See that man over there, he's your brother. She's your sister There's a part of each of us in one another The part that's on its way back home We come into this world spiritual beings From that which has been and always will find our way through life's suffering and uncertainty find a way that will take us home didn't jesus say to love one another and didn't mohammed say to love one another and didn't krishna say Doesn't the Torah say to love one another? Doesn't the Tao say to love one another? Love each other as we're traveling home. This world can rob a heart of its compassion. consequences of our actions but with love as a traveling companion love will show the way back home didn't king say to love one another didn't mandela say to love one another didn't romaris Find a way back home. Yep. Yep. This this next song, I, the first winter I was up here was the winter of '78, and I was living in Westboro. And forecast says it's going to snow. And I thought, oh, that's great. I started snowing, and it was snowing the next night. The next morning, it was snowing the next night. It was snowing the next morning. It was snowing, it's still snowing the next night. And I thought, goodness sake, what kind of godforsaken place have I got into? So I thought I'd chill things off here in the summer by doing a winter song called Damn Midwinter Blues. Well, I am a southern boy. I was raised in Tennessee, grew up on grits and sawmill gravy. 
sour mash whiskey. I never dreamed I'd live in New England and see the snow piled high as my side until I fell in love with this woman from Maine and took a Yankee for my bride. I've walked the streets of Cambridge I've took a subway to Park Square Sat on the benches in the common I've seen the things that happened there I've seen the decadence of Roxbury Drove a car through Jamaica Plain I can't help it everywhere I go Boston all seems the same Cause it's snowing outside, my car don't run and my insurance is due. I got two beers left and a refrigerator and my whiskey's all gone too. I got excise taxes a coming. I got doctor bills for the flu. Lord, I'm stuck here in New England with these damn men. This will, this will show you who might be a little older in the audience. <laughs> now there I was daydreaming about a warm southern sea cruise when I was brought back to reality by Don Kent on the news. He had a special weather warning about a storm coming our way. It's brewing up in Canada, it's moving in to stay. And it's snowing outside, my car don't run, and the insurance is due. I got two beers left in the refrigerator, and my whiskey's all gone too. I got excise taxes a come. I got doctor bills for the flu. Lord, I'm stuck here in New England. Stuck here in New England with the damn midwinter blues. Thank y'all. a little stressed out, <laughs> a little too stressed out for my health. <laughs> I had a, I had a whole bunch of bunch of things planned with a, a few little uh, an email sent that I never got and things like that. But <laughs> here I am, I made it. <laughs> so I I am I am fresh out of Berkeley College of Music, 
and um, I have, thank you, <laughs> I have decided to make sort of a theme in this, in this performance. I have five songs, and... Uh, um, What's your name? Hi, my name is Piper, hi. <laughs> Can you tell how stressed I am? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Um, I, I'm going to sprinkle through these um, two songs from my the wrong page. Two songs from my my writing at Berkeley College of Music, and three songs fr taken from a performance I used to do with a friend of mine, uh, Sarah. A friend of mine, Sarah, Sarah Zura. We did a theme, excuse me, a theme concert called. Stay Tuned, which was our own uh, re rearrangements of TV show themes. <laughs> and the game was to get people to try and guess. So I will open up with one of those. So try and guess this song. It's a TV show theme. Lucky guesses. Anyone? <laughs> no, it's not dark shadows. <laughs> Rosemary time. Close. I can. I can sound. Uh, I can hear where you're guessing. It is the um, uh, Beatrix Potter series. Animated series. This next song is a song from my uh, college. Uh, it is called I Am the Tortoise and You Are the Hare. And I wrote it from a uh, foreign uh, a friend of child, from childhood that we've, we've been friends for a long, long time. And the choices she made and the choices I made made our, our lives split in totally different directions that we had no no idea how it would go and what we wanted to be versus what we became drastically changed and so this is going to sound a little bit angry but in that anger is sadness because everyone has this moment in their life when their friends don't grow up the same as they do so i am the tortoise and you are the hare Take off your coat, the kettle's on, but you're so hot. 
won't sit still. I lay back, just take my time, but you've gone off on another thrill. Life is a race, then tell me, friend, what's there to win? I don't know, I know who I'll always be inside, but you're still looking through the rain and snow. Always used to say that I was miles away. you there but no go run 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 don't listen to me till it's done so I'm missing the fun at your party but tell me if that crowd is right when I see your face so bold and drawn I see the pain you hide at night in one ear and out the other and here we are almost done your life has changed and i am the same i wonder who really won you always used to say that i was miles away and you're right i am the tortoise and you are the hare you may be fast but i'll beat you there but no It's done. Go run, run, run. No, go run, run, run. But no, go run, run, run. We're back. Now, here's another theme, TV show theme, that you gotta try and guess. I'm guessing you will be able to get this a lot more than other people do. <laughs> to the stand. <laughs> this is Jordan Helzer, and he's going to help me sing my next song from, from Berkeley. It is called Seven, 1704, and this song is written, a retelling of the attack on Deerfield in, in, on February 29th, I believe. And um, it is written for, for two or more voices. 
and each verse is a different person's perspective on the many, the many colors, the many stories that make up this historic event, 1704. Seventeen hundred and four They will sing my name, De Rouville. A dark night for England, a victory for France The first attack that I command alone For this I will rise to no bold Cries of many colors cut the stories in the snow Still thawing the stockade since that winter Of seven the I am Eunice Williams But what life am I left? Without my little Jerusha and John Bodies fall before me, friends and family And still my captors brought me on Where has little Eunice gone? Cries of many colors carve their stories in the snow Still thawing the stockade since that winter of 1704. I am Wobanaki, a little girl walked with me. I took her from a careless Englishman. Trapped as mates have grown in that culture they are owned. Now she has respect, love for the land. And when Dot Man asks for her hand, cries of many colors carve their stories in the snow. Still thawing the stockade since that winter of seven. Mary Caitlin, servant to God, who gave a Frenchman water when he called. When will the blood stop? As may you man the twice caught with hatred for the savages forever hard. I am Ganenst and Awi. I am gonna walk I am she who was little Eunice I have lost my family I have found a home I could return But I cannot go My three children are of two worlds Cries of many colors carve the stories in the snow Still thawing the stockade since that winter Cries of many colors carve the stories in the snow Still thawing the stockade since that winter Of seven of In the year of our world, 1704, they will sing our names.
Thank you, Jordan. This is my last song, and back to the stay tuned. <laughs> Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> I'm glad I could make it. <laughs> I'm trying to understand the sign language from my mother, but I think I get it. <laughs> yeah, I figured that was a, that was a letter. <laughs> okay, all right. This is uh, this is the last. Um, stay tuned. An additional stay tuned. I'll give you a hint. Oh wait, what was the other one? The one you just Oh, sorry, sorry. Yes. Did anyone guess what that one was? It is, yes. Congrats. <laughs> now you gotta guess this one. <laughs> Give you one hint. It's not playing on a harp. <laughs> and you will soon find that out.
What was it? Anyone? Shall I give you a hint? He travels through time putting right what once went wrong. Quantum leap. That's it! Quantum leap! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for screaming in the mic. <laughs> I get so excited when I play that song. It's great. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, guys. You've been brilliant. Thank you. <laughs>guitar so it doesn't sound horrible for everybody okay Beautiful. we can make it sound better always strive for to be better even if it's a guitar
That song, I wrote that for a fictional girl, and even in my dreams, they, uh, they like to wander away. But it doesn't, co it doesn't stop me from chasing. It never does. <laughs>
I forgot how many songs I was supposed to play. Is that it? We're good? Yeah, I think it is. All right, cool. Anyways, I'm Michael Grafius. Uh, you can see me uh, this Friday at the uh, the Wheelhouse in Greenfield. I'm playing with uh, Silver Lake and some other bands. Thank you so much. Hope you have a good night.